Good evening and thank you for being here tonight for KION News at 6. We start with families who are struggling to get help here on the Central Coast. The Monterey Peninsula Unified School District announcing that they approved an emergency housing program for students who are experiencing homelessness. KION's Anna Torreya explains how it works. This Motel 6 here behind me will be one of two locations that will serve as short-term emergency housing for MPUSD students and families who are experiencing homelessness. In the past six months, we've been working with Motel 6 directly and collaborating on a partnership in order to um, identify a way that we can uh, provide an immediate access to short-term housing within Motel 6. The district says this program is the first of its kind. MPUSD will cover the costs for families now till June 30th, thanks to grant funding. Uh, we're able to utilize that funding to go directly to meet this particular need. For Families. Some families facing eviction, high cost living, or nowhere to go. The district hopes this new program will ease their burdens. Kayla Antes serves as a liaison for the program and already received a call from a family asking about it. It's critical, um, giving them this ability to be less stressed and take this burden off even for three days and give us time to work with the family to set up a more long term plan um, can really make or break it for these families. Antes tells KION families will stay at the motel for three three days, but they can extend it depending on the situation. This chart here by MPUSD shows that 22% of its student population is experiencing homelessness. The chart then breaks down what that living situation is looking like. We have a large percentage in comparison to other counties in the state of California who are experiencing homelessness. MPUSD is looking to expand this program because homelessness is not just Monday through Friday. It's every day. This program is funded by the American Rescue plan grant, which is from the California Department of Education. Reporting in Monterey, Anna Torreya, KION News Channel 546. Well, in order for students to qualify and get this assistance, they do need to be registered MPUSD students eligible for the McKinney Vento services. That's for homelessness services. Also, at the time of application, staying with family members and not have any other alternative housing options. The emergency housing program is open to grade levels, we're told.